This is the Upper Newport Back Bay Nature and Ecological Preserve, colloquially referred to as the Back Bay, is a natural estuary site located in one of the most northern areas of Newport Beach. It's approximately a thousand acres of open space with the nature preserve being the bluffs around the bay and the ecological reserve, making up one of the largest coastal wetlands in Southern California, according to the Orange County Parks website. It's one of the top birding sites in the country and considered a critical and pristine habitat home to nearly 200 species of birds, including several endangered species, states the Newport Bay Conservancy website. The Upper Newport Bay Ecological Reserve is 300, it's about 750 tidal acres, and it is managed by the California Department of Fish and Wildlife. So Newport Bay Conservancy's role, um, we were the nonprofit organization back 50 years ago that fought for its protection. So, you know, as the bay is already protected, the ownership of those tidal lands, that ecological reserve was given to Fish and Wildlife, and we're partners with them to help manage it, to help restore it, to keep it beautiful, and then connect people with that space. According to Heather Sizlack, Operations Director at Newport Bay Conservancy, if you look along the shoreline of Back Bay Drive or by the Aquatic Center, the life in the mud is often overlooked, but in a square foot of that, it can contain thousands of critters and worms and other things that help the bay thrive. During migratory season, we'll often see thousands of shorebirds on mud plants trying to eat these critters. Throughout the bay, the Conservancy puts up signs stressing the importance of staying on the trails while individuals hike. It could be potentially dangerous for the animals such as burying owls that nest underground. Sizak revealed that the Peter and Mary Muth Center is currently closed to the public. Because there is a kids room with a variety of hands-on activities, it is not safe to be opened yet. However, that facility, the parking lot, and restrooms are still opened every day so families can park and visit. She also reports that the Conservancy worked with the County Parks Department on the bluff area of the preserve to install some interpretive panels along the three mile, mile and a half bluff stretch where people can go hike and read about what they are seeing in the bay. The Orange County Parks website states that there are two important plant communities that are found on the bluffs, grasslands, and coastal sage scrub. The website also states that the Upper Newport Bay is a mecca for bicyclists, hikers, horseback riders, educators, and more. The availability of camping at Newport Dunes Resort makes Upper Newport Bay a desirable destination for people to enjoy the beautiful nature. Irvine Company wanted to develop the Upper Bay um, into mostly 70, I think it was around 70% private development. We wouldn't have the opportunity we have today to really be able to bike and hike and jog around the bay and nature watch. So we wouldn't have had that today. And so, you know, I, I think we're pretty fortunate um, here and I, I love it.